How's it going, everyone? I'm Aaron Tati. Welcome to the last episode of Wedding Walkthrough Wednesday. Yes, the series is going to be coming to an end, but I am so grateful that you guys have watched and came along this journey with me. Some of them videos were good, some of them were eh, but hey, we got it done. I said we do it and we got it done. Today we'll be talking about backing it up. So once all my libraries are archived and I'm ready to move on to the next project, this is what I do before I do that. I use Chronosync to back up all my footage and I'm a huge proponent of Chronosync just because like it's so easy to like duplicate drives or like copy drives from one drive to another and having two drives or two hard drives or two storage systems that are of equal um, storage capacity really helps. So I do have um, two Lacey 2 bigs. They're 16 terabytes each. So in, in essence, it would be 32 gig or 32 terabytes worth of storage. But again, I want that redundancy and having that ability to always back up my footage and having again, redundancy and peace of mind just in case one of my drives fails. And I believe I do have a, another video that I have about like my whole storage system. It's up here. <laughs> so when you do have Chronosync installed, this is what the interface kind of looks like. And then I have different like tasks for different things I want to archive. So my main one is archive sync. But my archive uh, drives are not attached at the moment, so it will tell you, "Hey, cannot locate uh, target." But again, I'm just I'm just like basically archiving or duplicating my drive from my archive main to my archive mirror. Hence the name main and mirror. Um, again, I am so clever at coming up with these names. Now I do other forms of backing up, not just that main archive one. The main archive one is for when I finish like an entire library or entire project. I do have a different task in Chronosync. It is called the main SSD sync. And this is when I, every time I get like a lot of work done on my editing drive or my main SSD for every project that I have going on, whether it's photos or videos, stuff like that. I do sync that con constantly just because like all the work in progress I have, I wanna make sure I still keep that. I don't know if my SSD is gonna fail. Again, like even though they are rated for more sustainability and not being like at fault for failing, I do want to have that more like peace of mind. So again, I have another hard drive, not a, not a SSD, but a hard drive that is also two terabytes that I do um, Chronosync and mirror that drive onto. But that's just a little look into Chronosync and why I back up my footage and my hard drives and mirror my hard drives. Just because again, redundancy, I don't know when something's gonna fail. Like it's, you never know. So just being like overly prepared in that case, especially when it comes to media, like this is like what you do to make money. You definitely gotta make sure that you have your media squared away and like safe. I am looking into getting like a NOS, a network attached storage, but that's in the future. Hopefully in 2022, I already have that. But uh, who knows? I mean, those are expensive, but well, well, well worth it. But that's all I got for today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed. Hopefully you enjoyed the series. Like we yo, we did it. Um, again, appreciate all you for watching. Hopefully you learned something along the way. Again, some of these videos are very short. Some of them were very long. Some of them were iffy. Some of them were actually pretty good. Like I'll actually like back some of the stuff I'd be saying. But hey, we got 52 videos done for the week or for the year of 2021. And I can't thank you enough for watching. I really do appreciate all your support. Like the video if you liked it. Share it if you're into that. Consider subscribing if you're not already. And hit that bell notification to stay up to date when I post new videos. As always, follow me on all the social medias at Aaron Tattoo Films. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace. Like, yo, what, what should I do for, for my next series? Should I daily vlog? Heck no, bruh. There ain't no way. Maybe like 2025. We'll see.